Bill and Carl Cox, I want to tell you about another thing you do. He had a glass eye. Not a real eye. He had two good eyes. But he bought a glass eye. And he would drop it in a soup in, in the restaurant in Japan. And he would shut one eye and squint and call a waitress over. And he'd fumble around with his spoon. And he'd look at her over with one eye squint. Well, she didn't know. She was looking at him. Finally, he pulls it up on the spoon and looks at it. Takes it and shakes it, palms it, yeah. does that with his thumb, and looks at it. <laughs> Scream, run away. <laughs> we used to do the dressing room. He's sitting there with all the young Japanese boys. And he looks through his bag. God damn it, he'd say. Someone stole my eye. I can't find my eye. He'd be looking through the bag and throwing everything out. He would have taken the eyeball and put it between his cheeks. Now he's bending over, looking through his bag, <laughs> and all the boys see this eye looking back at him <laughs> from this guy's keister. <laughs> oh no. Oh yeah.